it's Irina Z and in this video I'm going to show you how to add an image list element to your page. So first what you're going to want to do is add the element. You'll go ahead and click add element which is around the orange box. So again it's just like that and then you can search image and we're going to want to add the image list. So it'll look something like check marks right over here. Now under the settings for the image list element, you'll be able to go ahead and select an icon image if you do not want to use this one. Um, it needs to be 32 pixels. Um, you'll be able to go ahead and toggle the margin up or down, pushing the element up or down. You could select the font family right over here. You could also select the font size, so you go ahead and make this larger or smaller as you would like by toggling that bar. You could change the color by selecting any of the colors that are available in here or searching for a color that you would like and you could change the bold coloring as well to a different color just like that. Under the advanced settings you'll be able to go ahead and select the icon size or you could hide the icon right over here. Show icon or hide icon. You could also select the bottom border. It could be dark solid, dark dash, light solid, a light dashed. You can select an animation for a time delay for this element to appear to fade in after a certain amount of minutes or seconds or both or fade in with scale after a certain amount of minutes or seconds or minutes and seconds. You could also select an animation type which would be on page load so this element can appear on page load or this element can appear on page scroll. And that is how you would add an image list element to your funnel. If you run into any trouble with this, please reach out to our support team. They'd be more than happy to help. Thanks so much.